Here's a problem that asks about relative motion in two dimensions. Uh, these problems can be a little tricky to understand, so it helps to draw like vector diagrams of all the different motions happening. So the first thing the problem tells us is that this guy, Huck Finn, is moving at a, at a speed, a given speed, across his raft along the river. So if we imagine a river that is aligned like this, then that means that this first speed that we're given is perpendicular to the river in, the, in a direction that will just write as up. And it's 0 0.70 meters per second. It also mentions that the raft is traveling down the river at a speed relative to the bank. So let's say the river is flowing to the right, which means that this other speed is going to be pointing to the right relative to this, like a triangle. And this is a speed given as 1.50 meters per second. I forgot to write that in. Oops. But anyways, but because of these two speeds are adding together like vectors, the total speed is going to be directed somewhere in this direction, kind of like this, at some angle theta with respect to the horizontal. Now the first thing that we want to find is the speed and direction. So we want to find, so the first thing we want to find is this speed. Now because this is like a triangle where we have two components of speed that are perpendicular to one another, we can find the magnitude or the speed, or like the total speed, by using the basic principles of the Pythagorean theorem. We take the square root of both of these speeds squared and find their sum. So the square root of 0 0.70 meters per second squared plus uh, 1.50 meters per second, and that's squared too. So if we put this into our calculator, we find a total speed of 1.66 meters per second. And so that is the total speed at which Huck Finn is moving. The next thing we want to find is the direction, which we can answer just by finding this angle theta. So the angle theta, as it usually is, is equal to the inverse tangent of the y component divided by the x component. So if this is the x direction and this is the y direction, as they usually are, and that means we want to take the inverse tangent of 0 0.70 divided by 1.50. And we want to put that into our calculator. This is, this, this is the standard formula for finding an angle theta when we have a setup like this. So that's what we're going to use. And if we put it into our calculator uh, and you set it to degrees, we find an angle of 25 degrees. So theta is 25 degrees, which means that this angle, the direction at which Huck Finn is moving, is 25 degrees relative to uh, the horizontal, which in this case is to the river. So that is the best answer we can give for the direction of the motion. So that gives us an answer for the speed and direction of Huck Finn relative to the riverbank. So that is all for this problem. I hope this video helped you out. If you have any questions, please leave a comment down below and I will do my best to answer. I've got a Discord server linked in the description if you would like to talk more, have more discussion about these types of problems or if you'd like to make another request for later videos. But that is all for now, and that's all for this video, and I hope you all have a lovely night. Bye-bye.